Hello, today I'm going to be showing you the first few things that you should do after installing the newest distribution of Debian or Debian, which I say Debian, which is Debian 7 and the code name Wheezy. I'm going to be showing you the first few things you should do right after installation. I'm running in VirtualBox right now, as you can probably tell. Uh, so the first thing you want to do is log in. It's probably going to give me an error saying that GNOME 3 isn't compatible. Oh, it didn't. Awesome. That's probably because I already did that. Uh, so the first thing you're probably going to want to do is check for updates. Which would be software update. It will check. There are no software updates for your computer at this time. So we are all up to date on software and some of the first few things you might want to do is open up your root terminal. It's going to require your password just to open up your root terminal. But after you do it three times uh, it will save your password and allow you to just when you click root terminal automatically open up your root terminal and it's already root at your user and uh, these are our pseudo commands that Debian uses and um, you're probably wondering oh well how did you get the green font and black back background because Debian's uh, default is a white background with black text um, I'm going to show you that in a second, right after this. And this is just something I saw on Nixie Pixel, which is a great uh, Linux resource. I will be giving you a link to her YouTube videos in my description because I like to be able to help as many people as I possibly can. And I know Nixie Pixel is a wonderful resource, and I use her resources constantly. What SL does in the sudo apt-get install is uh, you have to do it in a regular terminal. Let's see if I can exit. Okay. So I go to accessories, terminal, I type in SL. Yay, we get a nice little steam locomotive instead of your LS, which is your listing of directories. But um, there's actually a good chance for me to show you about the color here. Uh, go to profile preferences, you go to colors, click on the use colors for system. Uh, I like having green, select, and my background being black, and select. And my bold color, same as text. And you close, and there you go, you have your black and green terminal, which it should be anyway. Um, so that's a little tips and tricks kind of thing. Um, if you want to know how to download and install videos, um, not videos, download and install any uh, software or anything, it does have um, a package manager and other ways to download software. I like using the terminals and downloading applications itself, um, but I will do another video on that for you guys. Uh, Debian 7 is very basic and just really gives you the greatest feel for Linux itself. Um, really, for the things you should really start off doing is as soon as you log in, applications, go to uh, system tools, and you check for a software update, you update anything, you make sure your computer is charging to the charger, um, then you want to check your package installer, and this is where you can find your packages and install them, and 
that's about it. That's really all you gotta do. Thank you for watching.